Hello, so welcome to my channel. I'm just going to put up things that I do anyway. Two of the main things I do is I do a show regularly, weekly for Resonance FM called The News Agents and the title The News Agents, it came from the fact that I used to work at Reuters on the media archiving and in Reuters, well it's the biggest news agents, but when I said I work for a news agency, people like just started thinking about news agents. And I kind of like the idea of the more ordinary news agents in terms of ordinary, in terms of, yeah, you find it on street corners, people walk in, there's all kinds of things there. So it's a little bit magazine-y, in fact people use that title, magazine show, but it, but having said that, um, I tend to dig deep into topics on the show, I don't really shove together random things in a similar show, it's more overall as a show, it is, um, it's magazine because the themes may be different, but I try to go in depth and I try to look at things that are international. Um, as much as I can, it's a little bit, um, it's not an exact science. Anyway, it's called News Agents. It's on Saturdays, 2.30 to 3.30 on Resonance FM. It's been going since 2014, so that's really a long time. I'm also a musician and a poet. Um, I've had some books published. I had a book published about Resonance, um, not Resonance, about Reuters, called For the Messengers, about the international news stories of the year 2008. That was published by Donut Press. There's a few copies left from me. If you're interested, give me a shout. It was endorsed by Jon Snow and some other great news presenters and, and poets as well. Um, so, yes. I'm still writing poetry. I've been writing lyrics for a particular project called Bobby Bluff. But um, more importantly than that, in my own life, for me, um, Montague Armstrong is my project that I do with Matt Armstrong that is music. And I have Hammond organs. And at some point, I'll be taking you on a little tour of my Hammond organ collection. And <laughs> it's turned into a collection at my shop. Let me show you my shop. Um, it's not really a shop, it's a workshop. I'm a printmaker too, as I said, I'm, well, I'm a general all-round artist, here's my, whoa, here's my press, oh, you can see it, this is a wonderful press put together by a guy who used to service the colleges up north in the UK, he used to do the press, um, servicing the technical requirements of the presses there, this was one of three presses he built for himself. And it's a thing of pride and joy, as people say, a work of art in itself. So I have a quick look around here. Some my prints that I do. This is how I earn a living, believe it or not. Let's have a look outside in the road. I'm in Hastings. I'm in Hastings, St. Leonard's. So here's my shop. Backwards, because it's on selfie mode, huh? And this is uh, King's Road, St. Leonard's. Where I live. It's up the groovy street. Very nice. Anyway, I wanted to also tell you about my interest in Latvian music. I've been learning Latvian and I'm um, singing songs. I'm going to be posting about them and also thoughts about speculative archaeology and other offcuts from my show too. So you'll be hearing a lot of stuff with Baltic themes and just sort of discussions about animation. And, um, yeah, so this will do for now. I thought I ought to do a new intro, intro to my channel because I've never really done one. And one of my great friends is Debbie Elliott, who runs an esoteric show channel here on, uh, on YouTube. So um, she's been a bit of an inspiration, getting a little bit more into the YouTube or getting more into the video vlogging. And um, I think she's great. She's an old friend from London, so... Yeah, a little bit modelled on you, Debbie. <laughs> so here we go. Welcome to my channel. I'm Jude Montague.